You're on true and welcome to another exciting day in our galaxy and it's time for another refit I haven't talked about yet. But before I talk about the D4 um, class refit, I just want to say if you are not a subscriber of my channel yet but do like my videos, then please do subscribe to my channel. And when you do, please also click this little bell and all notifications so you will be notified when another video comes out. But now let's either go to our ship hangar or the armory. My ship hangar is upgrading at the moment just another 331 days. <laughs> so we choose the armory in this uh, occasion and go to ship skins. And here, when I scroll down to the ones I've got, one of those is the D4 class refit. It's an epic ship skin. It gives the D4 class a nice look. I mean, the D4 is on screen. When you see it next to other ships, it's, it's really tiny, but uh, it's tiny with a lot of oomph, so to speak. And it gets better even um, with this refit. The refit, as usual, as the first info box says, can only be applied to the D4 class. It's with all the ship skins. You, they are always class specific. And so you cannot put this on another ship, but they do exist for other ships as well. But as usual, it is still a permanent buff. That means you don't need to have this refit on your ship uh, to have the bonuses applied to that ship class. You, of course, have to unlock it after you got all the shards. You have to unlock it here in, in, in the armory or in the ship hangar. But once unlocked, it doesn't matter if you put it on the ship or not, it will give you the bonus nevertheless. And this, uh, yeah, this week, I don't know, because with the new arc, um, I don't know yet how many uh, videos I have to make on new stuff. And that will shift back the, the normal schedule. Um, but in the days after, we will talk about a few more refits and uh, because they're quite helpful. This refit gives you a bonus that increases all base mitigation stats of the D4 class by 200%. And mitigation is sometimes, well, in general, all those abilities are good, but mitigation helped me through a lot of fights already because especially in, in, in cases where I had five of 11 uh, aboard a ship and uh, the mitigation was what, what kept me alive in, in some armadas, for example, while others of, of my alliance died. And so we still got the rewards. And so mitigation is something you shouldn't um, underestimate. And uh, everything that gives you more mitigation is not a bad thing indeed. And the D4 class refit has one nice bonus, this refit, because the D4 class can have more ship skins. And in that case, it's even more important that it is a permanent buff that you don't need to apply the skin to the ship because there, there are some other ship skins for the D4, uh, especially an original series one that I like much more than the, the red one. And so, um, you still get the bonus, even if you have the original series one, the, the D7 one on the on the D4, you still get the bonus from, from this red coat, so to speak. The nice thing about this one is that uh, you can get it via normal events. And if we go to the event store, you will not see it. But here in the Apex event, you earn on Thursdays, hopefully, those contraband chips. And uh, you get them, for example, from the highest loot contraband or from the ranking in the Armada hunt during the Apex event. And it's gone now from, from my uh, shop because uh, I, I got it. But you will find the D4 class refit right here. So the red D4 class refit will be here in the Apex event store until you unlocked it as well as the Enterprise and the Algo one. But the D4 one is in here as well. And from time to time, you will find them in uh, other events. But if it's in a special event like the Enterprise coins, for example, that we recently had, I'm not going for, for a refit like that because you get this regularly in-game via the Apex store. Um, so there's nothing I would spend those Enterprise coins in the last one of the Theleron events um, before that, where I would spend that on, on the D4 class, because 
everything you can get in game via regular events is not so much worth taking it uh, in, in, in the special events after the end of an arc. There's just one thing on the screen um, that I want to mention something again. I did the videos on the hijacked uh, ships uh, once, but the topic is coming up over and over again. Yes, it, unfortunately, they really don't make sense because you cannot scrap those ships. So it's from my perspective, I agree with a lot of commentators on my uh, on both channels, on the English and the German. Um, that they are a waste of resources because you can't even scrap them later on. And uh, once again, I'm in the position where those are the only thing I can buy with my rewards from the Apex event. I've got all the refits and now I've got contraband chips. As you see, I've got 7,000 and all I can spend them on is, is uh, blueprints for the hijacked ships. First of all, I built them once, but as a ship collector. Um, just to have them in my list. I'm not using them for anything except when the, there's once in a while there's an event where you can score a bit better if you use a hijack chip then I put those on auto level and then it's fine. Um, but if I have the time to do it I just hit higher level um, hostiles and get more points. But otherwise there's no use for them. But um, I just want to emphasize again you can not scrap them. That's the biggest downside of these hijacked chips. And uh, as I said, the, the topic came up over and over again. So that's why I just want to mention that again. Now we have them in front of our eyes and they are the only thing I can buy with my contraband chips. But nevertheless, I made sure I got the D4 um, class refit here in the Apex store as the first one. But that was because the D4 was my first Epic ship and I really loved it. Um, was from my point of view the best of the three um, epic ships of, of that class and uh, but I still got it for the Enterprise and the Augur as well and um, it didn't take that long but that depends on how good you are in the Apex event. Nevertheless if you want to say something about the D4 class refit then please write it in the comments and if you have questions in general or video requests, you know that I regularly read your comments. And if you want to see another video right now, the next one is right here in the end screen. I'll see you there. I'll be back.